Ricky Stokes, Senior Associate Commissioner, Mid-American Conference. You got one champion crown with the uh, Buffalo women. You got one more big one left. What, uh, what are you expecting tonight? I think it'll be a great matchup. Uh, they played twice. Both yep. of them have won uh, on their home court. Yep. And I would beg to say that uh, two of the deeper teams yep. uh, with yep. benches. So and they have a big guy. They have some guards. They have some wings. So yep. two talented teams. Both teams come in pretty full around the court in terms of what you want uh, balance-wise. Both teams, however, when they've looked well, they've looked really good on offense. And when they've struggled, they've struggled with their offense. What are you expecting? Buffalo uh, played a great half against, uh, or excuse me, a great game against Akron where they're clicking on all cylinders. Struggled a little bit uh, all game last night against Central. Buffalo, uh, excuse me, Bowling Green, great again in their, in their opener uh, against Ball, uh, Ball State. Great in the first half <laughs> last night against Northern, and then they went cold in the second half and they struggled. So what what are you looking at there? What do you think? You know what? You you made a good point. It's like the tail of two halves. Um, I think you saw the heart of a champion with Buffalo. They just kept hanging hanging around yep. against Central Michigan. Made enough plays at the end, enough free throws, and can't say enough about C.J. Massenburg, uh, his leadership yep. and how that played. Uh, the Bowling Green game was uh, one you have to scratch your head a little bit. They played tremendously well uh, in uh, the first half against NIU. Yeah. Give NIU a lot of credit. Uh, I think a lot of people thought that game was over. Yep. Uh, but it was a nail-biter at the end, and uh, Bowling Green made enough plays to solidify the victory, uh, too. Key, key player for both teams. I, I'm a, I'll go with Buffalo and let you have uh, uh, Bowling Green. Jeremy Harris was a big difference in the game against Akron. Uh, really struggled yesterday. I think he's got to come back and have and show up again tonight uh, to make it easy for Buffalo. Uh, I would uh, agree. Yeah, he's the he's the X factor. I mean, you know Massenburg, you know Perkins, right. but they have a little more breathing room when he started to play well. And you know what you're going to get out of Carruthers and Jordan and right. the rest of the host of the guys. And I think uh, I think Turner, Justin Turner, has got to got to have a big game for uh, Bowling Green. Uh, I don't think we've seen the best of him yet uh, on this stage. Uh, your thoughts? You know what, I think you're absolutely right, but I always would say Wiggins will have to have a big game as yeah. well. He'll yeah. have to defend Perkins, and the more that he can score and maybe get Perkins in foul trouble, the better. Yeah. And uh, Fry has had an excellent, yeah, he's uh, had an excellent tournament. Tournament here as well. Good. Anxious to see it.